like let your meat soak in this uh whatever you got it in let your meat soak in this apple cider vinegar put apple cider vinegar in here to clean it so i'm gonna let it soak in here for about at least 10 to 15 minutes now you're gonna add all your ingredients in here Added my ginger, my garlic, onion powder, garlic powder, my black pepper. I'm also adding a double seasoning, all purpose seasoning. Okay, this is what it looks like. I'm gonna let this sit aside and marinate for about maybe about at least an hour. Okay, while the meat is marinating, I got my uh, beans, my red beans in here. I'm gonna make some red beans and rice. I'm gonna cook this, boil this for about 45 to about an hour. I had uh, soaked it for about eight hours while I was at work. So it should be pretty decent now. So, okay. So like I said, I'm gonna cook this for about 45 to about an hour to at least get soft. So off camera, I added my diced onions, my garlic, and some all-purpose seasoning. So I'm gonna let it cook for a little bit. I'm gonna add a little water to it because it looks like it's drying out. So I'm gonna add a little bit more a little bit more water to it on camera again i added my scallions my thyme leaves i added the coconut milk in here added some butter some allspice and black pepper into my beans we're gonna stir that up all those ingredients and spices up in here up 
I wanted to add a pepper in here, scotch back, fried pepper, but it's too spicy for me. I don't like it in my rice, really, to be honest. So we're gonna let that cook. That's the uh, ingredients in here and then also included a thyme leaves. So now I'm about to add these oxtails back. There we go. All right. Okay. Added about four cups of water in here. And now I'm about to add my oxtail seasonings in here. Right. Well, time to get to cooking. I'm gonna cook this for about at least three hours. I check this bean to make sure that it's soft. It's a little bit soft, so it's almost getting there. So I'm just gonna go and uh, add the rice. I just added my rice in here and, and just add on one cup of more water here so I can let this rice cook. Okay. This was a fail because I believe I added too much water to this and it got so mushy to the point of me mushying up this rice. So I'm gonna throw this away and just head to the store and then just do it the cheat way. So this is going to the garbage. All right, got my onion. And garlic sauteing for a couple minutes. Oh yeah, I forgot, I'm sorry. This is for the cabbage. I'm making, uh, frying some cabbage. With this. For the cabbage. Okay, this up. All this in here. Okay, I'm gonna add the other half in here that I got left. Okay, I'm gonna let this cook down for about maybe about uh, no longer, maybe like about 10 minutes. All right, the food is practically done. Oh, that's a lot of cooking for many hours. Ooh wee But I'm gonna enjoy this. Hopefully you guys enjoy me cooking in front of you and showing you the ingredients and everything else that goes with this doggone meal. So I'm about to dig in, y'all. Y'all have a good one.